guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Judy, and today we're gonna do storytelling. And for today, it is Martina the Cockroach. So, let's begin. You must be thinking, a cockroach is always so ugly, scary, and lives in cracks on walls. But that is not this cockroach's way. This cockroach is a pretty cockroach, and she lives in a beautiful house. Once upon a time, there was a pretty cockroach named Martina. I told you she was pretty. She lived in a nice little house. I told you, she lived in a nice little house. One day, she found a gold coin while sweeping her floor. Wow, congratulations. But I'll tell you something. A cockroach has more than like one leg, like two legs. So you must be like really confused that she has so much arms so i'm just making it clear let's begin i mean let's continue what should she buy should she buy shoes should she buy candy no i will buy perfume she said look at her and she's thinking about shoes chocolates like it's muffins actually and perfume so she bought perfume and put it on then she fixed her hair and put on a pretty dress I never knew cockroaches had hair, or wear dresses, or wear lipstick, or have a beautiful pearl necklace. Martina looked and smelled, and smelled beautiful. Now, she was ready to get married, but she did not want to share her home with a noisy husband. If it's not a cockroach, how would any of the other animals fit into a little cockroach's house? Only an ant can, or like some insects, not a ma like animal. A cat came by and said, Marry me. What sound do you make? asked Martina. Meow, meow, he said. No, thank you, she said. Oh my God, even if she marries a cat, how would he fit into that little house? Let's move on. A rooster came by and said, Marry me. What sound do you make? asked Martina. cock a doodle doo he said. No, thank you, she said. Oh my God, she's plugging her ears. Do cockroaches even have ears? Okay, let's move on. A frog came by and said, Marry me, what sound do you make? asked Martina. Ribbit, ribbit, he said. No, thank you, she said. Rabbit, ribbit, ribbit. There's the little frog over there. Oh my god, I never knew frogs wear these kind of weird clothes. Wait, god, I just realized she has a purse, a pink color purse, and she's wearing a bangle. That's nice. A dog came by and said, Marry me. What sound do you make? asked Martina. Woof, woof, he said. No, take you, she said. There's the dog who is wearing Hawaiian clothes. Is the dog from Hawaii? Okay. Oh my god, look at her face. Look at the face of Martina. <laughs> oh my god, it looks so weird. Then a mouse came by and said, Marry me. What sound do you make? asked Martina. Kiki, key, key, he said. There's the lovely mouse. He's saying, Kiki. Key, key. He actually wears a real wedding dress. Oh, I love that sound. It's like a whistle. It is like music, said Martina. Look at her. She's in love with him. Martina and the mouse sitting on a tree. Martina and the mouse got married the next day. Wait a second, what's the name for the mouse? They only said the name of Martina, no one else. That's a bit weird, so we'll just call the mouse Mikey. All of their friends came to the wedding. The mouse's friends sang to the couple. Martina and the mouse lived happily ever after. And his soft sound was always music to her ears. Kiki! So that's the end of this story. I hope you liked it. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell. And don't forget to click the smashing, smashing like button. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye!